What's going on YouTube, GSNO right here. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to jailbreak iOS 13.4 and of course 13.4 beta. Now, this is going to be with the CheckRain jailbreak, which has been actually released in version 0.9.9 as an experimental pre-release. Now, when I say experimental, this is actually very experimental since 13.4 doesn't even exist as a release for the moment. There is only the beta available. Now, if you take a look in here, currently the latest version available is 13.3.1. But if you check the OTA in here you can see that there is the iOS 13.4 beta which is currently the beta 5. So if you are running 13.4 beta or when the iOS 13.4 will be completely released by Apple you are and will be able to jailbreak with the check rain. Now this experimental pre-release in here isn't actually meant for the general public but more for those of you who are willing to test it on various iOS versions and devices and stuff like that. QWERTY, one of the developers behind the check rain, posted quote check rain 0.9.9 experimental pre-release experimental 13.4 support. Place test on other firmware also. To run on iOS 13.4, tick the allow untested iOS versions checkbox in the options view. Now this is not part of the official website on the download page in here. Currently you can still get the CheckRain 0.9.8.2 beta. So if you go ahead here on the official website, the uh, pre-release isn't available. You actually have to follow the link in here by QWERTY, which goes to assets.checkRain.in test CheckRain in there. So this is basically a direct link. It's not available on the website website on the buttons in here for the moment. Because this is not meant to be used by the general public, it's not a stable build, it's actually an experimental build which adds 13.4 support. So it does support the 13.4 beta. Once you get that, you get the uh, check rain beta in here which is basically the DMG file that you have to mount and of course you drag it and drop it on your applications folder and it looks like this. Now he says in there that if you want to jailbreak 13.4 beta, you have to press in here options and tick this in here which says allow untested iOS, iPadOS or tvOS versions. Now if you want to see what's going on you can also enable the verbose boot in here and go back. So you press start at this point and of course you press next. Your device will go to the uh, recovery mode. I'm using a 13.3 device in here because I don't have one on 13.4 beta but the process would be completely the same. And once you get into the recovery mode you have to press start in here and then of course press the uh, power button and the volume down button or the home button depending on your device and of course then release the, uh, the power button but keep pressing the volume down or the the home button and at some point you're going to see that the device is in DFU mode like this device entered DFU mode and as you can see here is jailbreaking with check rain no problem so this is actually how you jailbreak your device if it's running 13.4 beta so it is definitely possible with this experimental building here the uh, check rain in here on the website may not work on 13.4 because this one although it does have that option to jailbreak untested versions it may not have the fixes that the check rain 0.9.9 has there is no change log available for the moment so I don't know exactly what changed from a version to another. But QWERTY also said in here, quote, oh, forgot to mention, this also adds support for demoting the T2 as well as booting into Pango OS with it. SSH and XNU boot is not working currently since we didn't bundle a T2 specific RAM disk. But this is for the T2 chip, which is not part of the uh, iPhone or whatever. So I don't think that's relevant for 13.4. At any rate, I do not recommend this for the moment. You should definitely wait for the 13.4 to actually be released because it's currently in beta. Once iOS 13.4 gets released finally for all devices that support the iOS 13, you will be able to jailbreak it with the CheckRain, which will probably be released in here. But if you want to do some testing for the CheckRain team, you can actually do what QWERTY says in here to test it on other firmware and stuff like that, the version 0.9.9, and of course test it on 13.4 on various devices that you have, and of course report your results to QWERTY in here, because that would definitely help a lot the CheckRain team to debug and of course to test the tool to see if it works on 13.4 and at the same time to check if it doesn't break the uh, compatibility with previous versions. But as you can see here it says all done so at this point we are jailbroken. So yeah, that's basically it with this tool. Now do I recommend it? No. As I said I don't recommend using experimental pre-releases if you're using it on your main device or if you're not tech savvy or if you don't know how to fix a broken jailbreak and stuff like that. Because this is not your average check rain that you can find on the website in here which although says beta is usually very well tested and all the known bugs are listed in here and all the unsupported platforms and changes and stuff are documented. This is actually a pre-release experimental posted on a direct link only for macOS from what I can see. So this is more intended for people who know how to test and who know how to fix the uh, check rain if something goes up and of course for people to report if the 13.4 support does work while the iOS 13.4 is in beta because they are probably trying to get the iOS 13.4 support up and running by the time iOS 13.4 exits the uh, 
uh, beta stage in here and goes into the public release. So yeah, that's basically it. There is technically an iOS 13.4 jailbreak at this point with Cydia, but as you probably know, CheckRain only supports the iPhone 5s all the way up to the iPhone 10. So the iPhone 10s, 10s Max, 10 R, or iPhone 11 or 11 Pro. So only the iPhone 10, iPhone 8, 8 Plus, and lower. So um, yeah, if you want to check it out, definitely do so. But do a backup of your device first with iTunes. So yeah, thank you for watching. I am GS Now. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.